Hello and welcome to Celebrity Reporter. In this video, we will be looking at Taylor Swift's incredible houses. From country girl to global pop star, Taylor Swift has come a long way. Unsurprisingly, she's built up a huge collection of houses over the years on the road to stardom, worth about $81 million, and her former New York City carriage house is now open overnight for stays. Her real estate portfolio is almost as impressive as her music career. Now let's take a look inside Taylor Swift's spectacular homes and discover the secret life of an international superstar. Taylor Swift's childhood home in Pennsylvania. Taylor spent her formative years on a Christmas tree farm in Cumru Township, Pennsylvania, before the Swift family moved 15 minutes away to this five-bedroom home in Wyoming, just outside the city of Reading. The high ceilings of the 3,560-square-foot Georgian colonial home would have provided great acoustics for the budding star, who had learned to play the guitar by the age of 12 and was performing at weekend festivals and events. The suburban residence was Swift's childhood home until she was 14, when the family moved to Hendersonville, Tennessee, so that she could pursue her career in music. On the market for just under a million dollars in March 2022, Taylor's former family home has undergone extensive interior and exterior renovations and is now decked out with the latest home technologies, as well as plenty of marble and granite. Taylor Swift's First Apartment Taylor's jump onto the property ladder happened in Nashville, Tennessee, where she launched her country music career with her first eponymous album in 2006. After You Belong With Me from her second album, Fearless, soared to number three in the charts, Taylor purchased her first property in 2009, when she was just 20 years old. Bought for nearly $2 million, the budding star picked up a 3,240-square-foot condo right in the heart of Nashville's Music Row as her first home. The star reportedly designed the interior for the apartment herself, which sits in the luxury Adelicia building, and described her style as whimsically girly. These images show another apartment in the high-end building, but Taylor's place would have had the same floor-to-ceiling windows with skyline views of Midtown Nashville and a state-of-the-art kitchen for the home-loving singer to cook up a storm. The corner unit penthouse had three bedrooms and four and a half bathrooms, as well as a balcony for Taylor to enjoy her morning coffee, she would also have had access to the super swanky amenities of the Adelicia complex, which include an Olympic-sized heated lap pool, a fitness center with an on-site personal trainer, and a private park. Taylor Swift's Cape Cod-style Beverly Hills home With the release of her 2010 album Speak Now, Taylor's music career went stratospheric. The six-time platinum album was more successful enough to able Taylor to buy a gorgeous old house in the celebrity hotspot of Beverly Hills. Secured behind gates and a long driveway, the almost one-and-a-half-acre home has a sports court within the private grounds and plenty of trees to keep nosy fans at bay. Purchased in 2011 by the star for $3.6 million, the 2,800-square-foot clapboard-sided home has four bedrooms and four bathrooms. Inside, the cozy living room features a grand fireplace, a built-in TV unit, and plenty of traditional-style fittings, the perfect place for some downtime following her album release. A pretty down-to-earth pad for one of the biggest stars in the world. There's also a modest kitchen, a formal living room on the lower floor, and French doors throughout, which lead to outdoor living areas. Upstairs, the master bedroom includes dual sinks in the ensuite bathroom and a walk-in wardrobe. 
A separate guest house attached to a two-car garage offers an extra bedroom and bathroom, plus an open-plan living and dining space with a fireplace and a fully equipped kitchen. In 2018, the star sold up for $4 million in an off-market deal. Taylor Swift's Nashville Estate 2011 was a busy time in real estate purchases for the singer. She bought this 5,000-square-foot Greek Revival-style mansion in June for her parents, Andrea and Scott. Sitting on almost six acres of land, the awe-inspiring property is known as Northumberland Estate. Located in the elite suburb of Forest Hills, home to glamorous celebrity neighbors such as Nicole Kidman and Keith Urban, it cost the singer $2.5 million and has four bedrooms and four and a half bathrooms. The home also boasts a spacious guest house, which covers 2,000 square feet and looks out over the swimming pool. Taylor Swift's mid-century modern home in Los Angeles. In 2012, when Taylor released her fourth album, Red, which sold 1.2 million copies in the first week of release, she bought this mid-century modern home in Los Angeles for $1.8 million. The wonderfully retro property was a change in architectural style for the star. The leafy back garden features a lagoon-style swimming pool, while decking and a central courtyard create additional living space outside. Swift sold the home in 2018 for $2.7 million, making a nice profit from the sale. Taylor Swift's Rhode Island Beach Mansion By 2013, the singer purchased this 11,000-square-foot beach mansion, on Rhode Island's Watch Hill for $17.8 million. Apparently, Swift paid for the seven-bedroom, nine-bathroom home in cash. Now that's what we call flash. The mansion overlooks 700 feet of shoreline with views of Block Island South and Montauk Point. A dream vacation home. It's the perfect pad from the busy star to get away from it all. Taylor Swift's Tribeca Penthouses In 2014, Swift bought not one, but two adjacent penthouses in an old Tribeca building, converting them into one large duplex that has a total of 10 bedrooms and 10 bathrooms, a billiards room, and an incredible sweeping staircase. The coolest part, she bought these homes from Lord of the Rings director Peter Jackson. With a total of 8,300 square feet, the apartments have a combined total of nine bathrooms and nine bedrooms with private wraparound terraces that add an extra 6,000 square feet to their already vast floor plans. Characterful features include the 12-foot high beamed ceilings, wide plank wood floors, and exposed brick. You have to admit, Taylor's got style. Taylor Swift's Los Angeles Mansion The 33-year-old singer went on to buy another Cape Cod-inspired home in 2015, only expanding her celebrity property portfolio even further. Swift bought the seven-bedroom home from legendary Hollywood producer Samuel Goldwyn's family for $25 million. In 2018, she applied for and won landmark status for the estate, ensuring that the home will never be significantly changed or demolished. Old Hollywood glamour can be seen throughout the home, evident in the grand sweeping staircase and curved walls in the hallway. Swift is the first person to own the home outside of the Goldwyn family, whose legendary parties once included the likes of Clark Gable and Charlie Chaplin. Taylor Swift's New York City Townhouse In 2017, Swift added a third New York property to her portfolio in the shape of a glamorous townhouse. Costing the star a whopping $18 million, the townhouse is just two doors down from her penthouse. 
The 5,000 square foot, four bed, four and a half bathroom home is spread over three floors and features a host of luxury amenities, including a movie theater, heated floors, a gym, a rainfall steam shower, and a limestone jet bathtub. Taylor Swift's fourth New York property. In February 2018, Taylor purchased another condo in the same building as her vast penthouse. It was bought from financier Jeremy Phillips for $9.8 million in an off-market deal. With three bedrooms and two and a half bathrooms, the loft has 3,540 square feet of space, high-beamed ceilings, cast iron columns, brick walls, and huge oak-framed windows impart no end of charm. The open chef's kitchen has a restaurant-style stove, an extensive pantry, custom cabinetry, and a large granite island. The sleek bar area is the perfect sociable spot for Taylor to entertain her New York friends before a lavish dinner party. We are super excited about you watching our videos and look forward to your continued support. It means the world to us. See you in the following videos.